Hello and welcome back to Fallout New Vegas. So I'm over here at Ranger Station Echo, and this time I decided to continue checking out some of these places I haven't been to yet. I'm going to head over here first and a few other places that I haven't picked up. And yeah, so let's see what this prospector camp is. Pretty sure it's fairly simple, but I still don't want to uh, continue with the bounties missions quite yet. Just want to avoid all the crashing problems that I've been having with them. I mean, I still get crashes, but that's that's just how it goes with Haunted Fallout. Hopefully, oh, I need to set my FOV. Got it. There we go. Much better. Can't go far without running into these pricks. Yeah, yeah, shoot me all you want. Oh, God. That's... <laughs> I have this thing with shooting guns out of people's hands in, in 3 in New Vegas. Every time I, like, free aim, it seems like I hit him right in the weapon. I bet you I've killed a lot of assassins at this point. Take that. <clears throat> I usually save the uh, faction money for when I go and uh, do casino stuff. Trade it out for chips, you know. Saves me caps. Which I gotta, still gotta do that sometime here. I haven't really done much with the casinos. I also have some missions in, uh... The, uh, I haven't even been into the, uh, Ultralux yet, but there is at least one mission, maybe two. I don't really remember associated with that place. We'll get to that. Lots and lots to do in this game, especially if you plan on doing a bunch of different quest adventure mods there's just I looked at my play time for this this game when I uh booted in at 78 hours this uh, playthrough actually started over a year ago at this point too it's been going on a long time been quite the journey we're not even close to done yet See how many of these I have. I think I'm getting close to being able to actually make it worth my time to explore the Sunset Sarsaparilla camp. Ah, I got 50. I've got enough now. So maybe we'll do that next time. That one's going to take a little while to do in and of itself, so probably not this time. But now I can actually do what's in there. Um, I wonder if I can walk there from here easily or from have to do a bunch of mountain climbing pretty barren out here not a whole lot to see no man's land and yeah, there it is down along the river though there is a few points of interest not marked ones there's a there's a uh, death claw camp basically down there, which is a place that you can find a, uh, one of the Enclave Power Armor Helmets. I see some more Legion, of course. I need to repair this thing. <clears throat> I don't remember there being a Legion camp out here. Hmm. Let's get a little closer. I'm, it is Legion, right? Pretty sure... I don't remember this camp. Oh yeah. Legion. <laughs> uh, 
They're like, what? What's going on? Now I hit him. Oh no. Ow. That was quite the throw. Go over here and check this out. I don't remember this. I'm gonna quick save constantly because I don't trust this game anymore. After that venture through the second New Vegas bounties. Well, the last episode I recorded, I only crashed once, which is a miracle. It's funny because when I first started, like, I haven't gotten. Like the, the mod count's still not real high compared to how high it could be. When I first started this playthrough, it was really stable. Just slowly gets less stable over time, I guess. I've changed up mods some, but it's mostly been visual stuff. Can I get up here? Come on. Go. Here is the entrance. I hate it how you can't climb shit like this. Like, come on, man. Hands and knees, get up here. Wait a minute. No. Oh. Legion, <coughs> Legion mine. I don't remember this one. See some angels out front. What is this? Hollowed out. Oh, it's not pages. Okay. I'm not sure how you pronounce that. Takata cup. Takata. Did something mine? Don't know. Ooh, the frame rate's kind of ruddy in here. There's a legion mine. Come on, Vance. You know what, let me ch Hmm. Just checking. See if hardcore mode was still on. It is. Just thinking about it, it seems like I haven't gotten... ...hungry or thirsty in a while. Okay, that goes up. That goes down. Let's go up first. Hello? Fruits. <laughs> Take your money. Bet you I've got lots and lots of 20 gauge rounds at this point. <coughs> Pardon me. <clears throat> got a prisoner. Hey, buddy. I'm getting out of here. Yeah, you do that. Just don't go down, because I haven't cleared that yet. Stim pack. Some food. Random stuff. All right. Another prisoner. 
Yeah, I don't I don't remember this mine. Got this was here. I'm getting out of here. You do that. Go on. Be gone. Magazines, some armor, not much. All right, let's go down. I'm gonna assume there's probably more prisoners or something. Super stim. Here, I'll take the food. Don't really need magazines. Okay. Oh boy. Bunch of recruits. Cave of Recruits. cave, I guess. Managed to, uh, get a few prisoners. Legion armor. Alexis, what the hell? Huh. Don't remember this guy. Storage key. I can't help myself. I know some people don't even like to use vats and fall out, but I can't help myself. It's too much fun. Why were they all camped down here, surrounded by a ton of radioactive waste? This seems silly. Seems like a bad place, and there's been people here a while too. violent. This is a bad place to have a hideout. Stupid legion. Alright, well I guess that's it for this mine. Gonna head out and I'll probably have to fast travel somewhere closer and we'll pick the next place to check out. Alright, so I came over to the Gibson scrapyard. Wait until morning. Or waited till morning. Got a lot of stuff on me. And yeah, it is bright and early. So I'm gonna head over to Southern Nevada Wind Farm. And then we'll go to the Cursed Cazador Nest. I don't remember if there's anything interesting over here or not, or if it's just a kind of minor spot. Guess we'll find out. Interesting looking weather, whoa. Oh. Under attack by a mole rat. Now, if I remember correctly, this place is full of Cazadors also. Oh dear. Ah. And I froze. That's nice. Okay. Alright. Waited a little bit longer this time until it was actually daytime. Other place I don't really remember much about. 
think it's just a bunch of windmills, maybe a shack with some stuff in it. And Kesadors. Of course, my favorite. I think I have a bunch of anti venoms on me because the next place I'm going is the Kesador nest. Take them all out. Little bastards. Come on now. <clears throat> this is kind of a cool picture, isn't it? Alright. Let's see what's in this place. Maintenance shack. Uh, looks like a bunch of spare parts. Oh, a skill book. Nice. Yep, if you're into crafting, which is kind of not really too... Uh, I don't use it much in New Vegas. I did when I first got the game, because I thought it was cool that you could craft stuff, like, a lot more than three. <laughs> but after playing 4 and uh, 76 so much, I really just don't bother with crafting much. I think that's it, though. Just the maintenance shed. Okay. See if there's anything else scattered out here. <clears throat> Some old school windmills. There is a dead or that's a casador. I thought that was a skeleton for a minute. Okay, well nothing much. <clears throat> Excuse me. Let's just jump up the road a bit. We'll go over to the Casador nest. Even though I'd really rather not. I used to use this as a player home or storage spot a lot on Xbox and then I <coughs> later on PC for a while. <clears throat> There's actually not a whole ton of really that great of player homes for uh, New Vegas in my opinion. A lot of them are kind of crummy. Or just not my taste I guess. I really like the one I have though, the Jacobstown one. It's nice and simple. Not to, uh, overkill. And a quick save before I go over here. This is one of those places I always avoid. In other playthroughs. So I don't remember if there's anything interesting in here or just a bunch of Cazadors. Devil bugs. How the hell did you get up here? Oh my. Come on, bats. Come on. Jesus. I hate it. How does that? Oop. Wrong key. <laughs> Another one. That wasn't so bad. I remember there being more. Hmm. Okay. See what they got down here. Uh, dead man. Adventurer's pack of. Ammo, explosives crate. And that's it. Okay then. Well, at least I can say I've been here. 
few dead people, actually. Alright. <clears throat> so, now that those are out of the way, I guess we'll head over to the Black Rock Cave, or probably Eldorado Substation first. Because, uh... I can't remember what... <coughs> God, excuse me. I can't remember what quest that's associated with. I think it's something for House, if you're helping him. You have to go to this substation for something. Don't remember, though. In fact, I think it's occupied by NCR, and I think I'm not really allowed in there. So we'll find out. This, uh, dry lake out here is a good place to find jalapenos. You like, uh, crafting food. Yeah, it's just a power plant. Yeah, I'll have to look that up. I don't remember. I remember coming out here for a quest for some other faction. Pretty sure it was House. Did something in here. See if they get pissed if I go inside or not. Look all you want. Just don't mess with any of the equipment. The control room. Stay out of the control room and enclosure or there's going to be trouble. Got it? It's off limits and so is the enclosure. Okay, so they don't want me to go in. Raiding parties. They'd love to shut down the Dorado. Let's quick save. And let's go in anyways. Just to see if they kill me. A bunch of NCR sleeping in here. They're gonna get up and be like, hey! Oh, this one's hostile, is he? I've got you now. Oh, okay. Okay, fine. They don't want me in here. <laughs> so... I don't think there's anything important in there anyways, unless you're doing the quest, so... Let's just not mess with it. We'll head down here, or from here, to the Black Rock Cave. <clears throat> I can't remember if the Black Rock Cave is the one that has a unique weapon or not. Maybe. One of these caves for sure did. I used to remember, or I used to know where all of them were, but over the years and through having weapon mods, I forgot where most of them are. I know that there's one in that Deadwind Cavern. There's a few locations, uh, more minor locations I haven't gone to yet just because they're filled with death claws. That will be for another time because there's, well, there's Deadwind Cavern and then there's the uh, unmarked location along the Colorado River. Just south of uh, Hoover Dam that I want to check out sometime too. Is entrance down or up? Here it is. <clears throat> oh, Nightkin. Oh, shit. It's got an incinerator. Bumper sword. Huh. Nah, I'm not gonna take any of that. Uh, uh, I keep having to pause to close my door back up. Dumb cats. Just can't leave it alone. Oh, there was nice soccer's or Oh, it's a coyote. Ouch. Hate incinerators. Ever since Broken Steel on Fallout 3. Getting swarmed by Enclave ones. 
Dead Prospector. Oh yeah, there we go, the Paladin Toaster. Which is a, uh, let's just show you. Power Fist. It's kind of hard to see in here. Uh, kind of hard to see, but yeah. It's like a Tesla Power Fist kind of thing. Pretty cool. I think I'm really going to use because I don't really do melee, but... Unique weapon to add to the collection. Let's see if there's anything else. Nope. That's that. Okay. Well. Unique weapon acquired. Let's get out of here. And pick somewhere else to go. Okay, so I think... Oh, I haven't been here yet? Really? Huh. Okay, well, I'm gonna go here and then here. Vault 19, I'm gonna leave for its own video. And we'll head over some of these places I haven't been to yet. Stupid glare, I can't see if there's anything else around. I think that's more or less it for now. Huh. Could have sworn I've been here before. Alright. Oh, I'm thinking of the emergency rail yard when I, I went to on the Vegas Bounties quest. This it? Yeah, okay. Okay, just in case, I'm not sure there's death claws at this one. I know there's death claws over kind of in this area. <clears throat> Don't remember this one can't see yet. Kind of over just south of Vault 19 also. Usually death claws. It's like these uh kind of bizarre area where there's these uh oh death claws. Sunken houses. Lucky they didn't see me. I think this one knows. Knows now. Yeah. Probably not all of them. Oh, there's a few up here. Gonna quick save like crazy here. That's sneak critical. Armor piercing 50 rounds. Lot of XP for killing those guys, rightly so. I don't remember if there's anything particularly of interest here other than a map marker. Oh, there's death claws over there. A map marker further up the road in death claw land. Yeah, it's boarded up. Junction 15. Some caps. Star cap. Or, that wasn't a star cap. This one might be. Nope. Bummer. Okay. There's a bunch of them. Lovely. up there too. No, I hit that one. Crap. Oh shit. I get nervous when these things get anywhere near me. Death Claws in 3 and especially New Vegas on hardcore mode make me very nervous. The ones on 76 actually make me pretty nervous, too. <clears throat> the death calls on 4 were kind of pushovers, honestly. 76 is different because, well, the whole game's new to me. 
But the ones on here, oh my god. You hunt them like that, you're alright, but... Getting surprised by them is no bueno. Guess I've been into that farmstead. Pretty sure that there is going to be more death claws over in this area. You'll see when I get closer, there's some like half sunken building remains or something. This whole area of the Mojave out here, I used to use it a lot for the, uh, the wasteland defense mod, which was basically setting up bases to defend before Fallout 4 came around. It's a fun mod. Nice and wide open and flat around here, though. It was good for making bases. Yep, there's death clones. Can't really see the buildings I was talking about. Let's just avoid them for the moment. Maybe it's just the one. I think I'm too far away. Anyhow. The hell? It's here. Uh -huh. Oh. See if we can get them all. <laughs> Got a plasma rifle. These must be some of the ones that are from Vault 19. Vault 19 is full of powder gangers. And it's got its own little story, so I'm gonna leave that one alone. Vault 19 until another episode. B12 Rex. Oh dear. Oh, it's froze. Oh, what's with the stutters? Every time I close. Okay. Shotgun shells. Ah, oh, it's one of these. I'll sell that. These uh, modded ones that are in the loot table are worth a fair amount of cash. Caps. Let's see what's in the ranch house. Note, looks like. Calm down. Stay kit. The much. Ammo. Read notes. The note reads, I'm taking most of the boys west to go check out this vault we heard about. Stay here and keep an eye on things until we get back, and keep a closer eye on the fiends. Those guys are crazier than Scrambler. If there's any trouble, radio ahead. Okay. So, this place is connected to Vault 19. Anyhow. Whoa, are you seeing that? In the sky? A graphic glitch. Interesting. Okay. So I want to pass up even getting near Vault 19 right now. So I'm going to go to here. Then we're going to go to these two places. Pretty sure I already cleared out Bonnie Springs. I don't remember if I got the... There was that melee weapon, the unique weapon called Love and Hate, that you can get from there. I'm pretty sure I found it. Oh, now it's full of casseroles. Nice. Okay, my game is kind of freaking out. Not sure why. This is the one that had it. That's why the corpse is still here, probably. I always wondered why they didn't uh, do more with Bonnie Springs. Just kind of a ghost town, everything's boarded up. Is this the... The con camp that's in the quarry? No, it's not. Hmm. Okay. 
Because I was going to say, I'm pretty sure I've been to that one. Go up and see what this is. If I can even get up here. That. Uh, just barely. I remember my first time playing New Vegas. Right after Good Springs, I basically... <coughs> excuse me. I ba Oh, what? I went the wrong way. It's Vault 19. God damn it. I, uh... I wanted to go into Vegas, like, immediately. And so I, from Good Springs, I took this route up. And I remember running into those Death Claws right there. And then I tried taking the other route, the main route, up. And ran into the Death Claws outside Quarry Junction. Oh. Graphic bug. Gotta restart. Hold on. Okay. Carrying on. There's nothing you can do about that. I, I'm not sure if it's the retexture mods or the ANB or something. Terrain just randomly goes black like that. What the hell? Don't look familiar. Hold on. I just want to take a screenshot. Because that's kind of a cool picture. I don't hmm. Maybe I just never noticed them because they're not usually all clustered like that. Those cool plants. Ah, uh, my friends, the Cazadors. Pretty sure the Khan camp and the tribal villager on this road both are really... I don't remember this road barely at all. Maybe because I'm usually coming from the other direction. Oop. Oh god. Makes me nervous when it freezes like that. Definitely con area, you can see there. The things there. Totems. Guess. Oh. Kind of like a cool nod to uh, Fallout 1. The uh, raider camp, the first one you ran into, had a... Uh, like that. It's a campfire and a bedroll. Alright. Head on up to the tribal village. <clears throat> it's kind of impressive going this way. Almost level 56. Alright, this is where we break off. That way it'll just lead me back to Good Springs, so... And this is also the part where we start finding a bunch of dead people. Burned dead people. <clears throat> I'm not sure if this was supposed to have been a con camp or not. I never... Maybe I'll find some clues. Or if it was just a random settler camp or what. See if we can get them all in one swoop here. Probably not. <coughs> yep, 
Yeah. Pardon me. Yeah, crap. I just really hope I was gonna get away with it. not using anti venom this time. Can't tell if I've been poisoned or not. Maybe not. Maybe I got lucky. There's a path down that way too, huh? Nope. We're starting to get to the point where I'm just leveling things that I didn't even need. It's alright. At some point, once I run out of actual vanilla perks, if I get that high enough in level, I'm gonna have to get the, uh... I'm gonna have to get the one that adds some more perks. I don't- I definitely don't take all these. Wait. Karma's reset? No, no, no. Uh... Yeah, there we go. Start using laser weapons at some point here. I mean, I've used them some, but... There's a ton of dead fiends and... It's like the fiends came in and killed everyone, then the... <coughs> me. And then the Cazadors came in. Now the crows are here. Stims. Random food. Like a double massacre here. Okay, so Yeah, not much other indication. <coughs> oh, sorry about the coughing. I gotta stop recording here anyways, because uh, I think I'm done for now. I picked up most of these places I wanted to see. I also really need to go get a drink of something. So, I'm not sure. I think next time... I don't really want to go back into the bounties quite yet. Again, I did a whole bunch of it. Still got a few places I haven't been to yet. I'll probably do Walking Box Cavern and Deadwing Cavern the same time I go after that Death Claw camp out there. And yeah. So, I'll probably do Vault 19 next. I don't know. We'll figure it out then. But I'm done for now, so I'll see you guys next time. Take it easy.